Welcome to Production Logistics and Transportation Management. After our quiz, we start a new topic today. The topic is called Product and Process Design. And we start with the first part, which is about product design. Uh, we will cover in this uh, short lecture, we will cover the product design process. We will go into details of the break-even analysis. We will use the break-even analysis to make decisions between uh, different products. We want to decide which product we should produce. And finally, we will discuss concepts that impact the product design. The learning goals for today's lecture are the following. The successful student will be able to explain the steps used to develop a product design. So be careful, explaining something is more than just memorizing the individual steps. You should be able to explain what's going on in these steps to your friends, to your fellow students, to your family members. You also will be able to use the break-even analysis to decide between alternative products and processes. From logistics management course, uh, you already know the break-even analysis, though we will repeat this concept and give it some more details. Um, I do this because the results in the previous quiz during the logistics management course about the break-even analysis was so-so. Uh, so I think it's best to discuss this topic again in a different context. And finally, as the last learning goal for this uh, lecture, the successful student is able to explain different manufacturing concepts that will influence the product design. Be careful. Um, this lecture is based on the textbook by Raid and Sanders. It is the chapter 3 of the Raid and Sanders textbook. You can find it in the learning resources uh, in Moodle or in the library of Geotech. And why did I say be careful? Um, during logistics management and during the beginning of this course in this semester, I had the impression that many students only rely or major, the majority relies on preparing the slides only and that's not what studying is about, just uh, trying to learn from the slides. Studying is also about getting different opinions from different authors on the same subject and one way to start learning in this way is really reading the chapters of the textbook. Though for this lecture I will not provide all the details on the slides. You will be required to read uh, the details also in this chapter of the textbook. And this is why I said please pay attention 